Hi, this is Dr. Rajeshwar from YR PharmaTube. In the previous video, we discussed the benzoic acid derivatives of local anesthetics. If you did not watch the video, hit the i button on top right of this video to watch it. To learn the other topics of local anesthetics and medicinal chemistry, click on the links given in the description below this video. In this video, we shall learn the amino benzoic acid derivatives such as benzocaine, butamben, and procaine. Benzocaine Benzocaine is structurally an ethyl ester of para amino benzoic acid. Its IUPAC name is ethyl amino benzoate or ethyl 4 amino benzoate. It is an ester of para amino benzoic acid lacking the terminal diethyl amino group of procaine with anesthetic activity. It is a benzoate ester having 4 amino benzoic acid as the acid component and ethanol as the alcohol component. It has a role as a topical anesthetic, as an antipruritic drug, an allergen and a sensitizer. It is a benzoate ester and a substituted aniline. Benzocaine is prepared from toline. Toline is initially nitrated with nitric acid in sulfuric acid solution forms para-nitrobenzoic acid. This is then oxidized using potassium permanganate in which the methyl group of 4-nitrotoline converts to a carboxylic acid to give 4-nitrobenzoic acid. This oxidized compound is esterified by heating with ethanol and a few drops of sulfuric acid resulting ethyl 4-nitrobenzoic acid. This is finally reduced with tin and hydrochloric acid to yield the desired compound benzocaine. Benzocaine is sparingly soluble in water. It is more soluble in dilute acids and very soluble in ethanol, chloroform and diethyl ether. The melting point of it is 88 to 90 degrees centigrade and boiling point is about 310 degrees centigrade. Benzocaine binds to the sodium channel and reversibly stabilizes the neuronal membrane which decreases its permeability to sodium ions. Depolarization of the neuronal membrane is inhibited thereby blocking the initiation and conduction of nerve impulses. Benzocaine is sold under the brand name Oragel. It is a local anesthetic drug commonly used as a topical pain reliever or in cough drops. It is the active ingredient in many OTC analgesic ointments. It is also combined with antipyrin to form otic drops to relieve ear pain and remove ear wax. The next drug is butamben. Butamben is structurally the ester of 4-amino benzoic acid and butanol. Its IUPAC name is N-butyl 4-amino benzoate. It is an amino ester resulting from the formal condensation of the carboxy group of 4-amino benzoic acid with the hydroxyl group of 1-butanol. It has a role as a local anesthetic. It is a benzoate ester, a substituted aniline, an amino ester, and a primary amino compound. Butamben may be synthesized from 4-nitrobenzoic acid, which is esterified with N-butanol that forms 4-nitrobutyl benzoate. The nitro group of this compound is then reduced to amino group using tin and hydrochloric acid gives butamben. Butamben is a white odorless crystalline powder that is mildly soluble in water and soluble in alcohol, ether, chloroform, fixed oils and dilute acids. It slowly hydrolyzes when boiled with water. The mechanism of action is similar to that of other local anesthetics. Butamben is sold under the name Alvogil in Spain and in Switzerland. It is one of the three components in the topical anesthetic Cetacaine. Its local anesthetic properties have been used for surface anesthesia of the skin and mucous membranes and for relief of pain and itching associated with some anorectal disorders. And the last drug is Procaine. Procaine is better known as Novocaine. Procaine is an amino benzoic acid derivative with local anesthetic and antiarrhythmic properties. Its IUPAC name is 2-diethyl-amino-ethyl-4-amino-benzoate. Thus, it is a benzoate ester, a substituted aniline and a tertiary amino compound. It has a role as a short-acting local anesthetic, a CNS depressant, a peripheral nervous system drug and a drug allergen. As the structure is found to contain 2-diethyl-amino-ethanol 
and 4 amino benzoic acid moieties it can be formally derived from a 2 diethyl amino ethanol and a 4 amino benzoic acid procaine was first synthesized in 1905 it is synthesized in two methods the first method consists of the direct reaction of the ethyl ester of 4 amino benzoic acid with 2 diethyl amino ethanol in the presence of sodium ethoxide the second method of synthesis is by reacting 4 nitro benzoic acid with thionyl chloride which gives the acid chloride which is then esterified with n n diethyl amino ethanol Subsequent reduction of the nitro group by hydrogenation of the resulting ester into an amino group that takes place in the presence of Rani nickel catalyst. Procaine hydrochloride occurs as colorless crystals or as a white crystalline powder which is freely soluble in water. It is kept protected from light and it is metabolized in the plasma by the enzyme pseudocholinesterase through hydrolysis into PABA which is then excreted by the kidneys into the urine. Procaine acts mainly as a sodium channel blocker. It binds to and inhibits voltage gated sodium channels thereby inhibiting the ionic flux required for the initiation and conduction of impulses. In addition, this agent increases electrical excitation threshold, reduces rate of rise of action potential and shows nerve impulse propagation thereby causing loss of sensation. Procaine is most commonly used in dental procedures to numb the area around a tooth and is also used to reduce the pain of intramuscular injection of penicillin. Today, it is used therapeutically in some countries due to its sympatholytic, anti-inflammatory, perfusion enhancing and mood enhancing effects. It is mainly used for infiltration anesthesia, peripheral nerve block and spinal block. It has also been investigated as an oral entry inhibitor in treatment experienced HIV patients. This is the list of references followed for the lesson. That's all in this video, the amino benzoic acid derivatives such as benzocaine, butomben and procaine. We will discuss the other amino benzoic acid derivatives in the next video. Till then, never stop learning and never stop watching my videos. Thank you for watching this video.